di Alezzano in particolare perché... Since the triumph of the right-wing alliance in Italy's general election, advocates for women and the LGBTQ community are worried about their future. Many fear far-right leader Giorgia Meloni, who is set to become the next prime minister, could adopt anti-queer and anti-abortion policies. It's terrible news that we were expecting. The polls were clear, but when something like this materializes, becomes real, it's pretty shocking. Here in the eastern region of Marche, which has been under Meloni's party for a few years, abortion rights have already been eroding. But this town remains the only place where women can receive an abortion because many doctors refuse to carry out the procedure in the area. We have plenty of stories like this too many. Elsewhere, women are forced to move to another region. Others have to get an illegal abortion. Some go abroad, or other women don't even have the option of an abortion. Certain experts fear that Meloni's future policies could bring setback for civil rights. I think the single most dangerous element of Giorgio Meloni is not a return to fascism in Italy, but a cutting down of civil rights for women, for gay people, for people who are not white, for immigrants. I think Giorgio Maloney has a social policy that is perfectly similar to Trump. I think she will take away or try to take away many civil rights. Italy ranks 23rd in the EU when it comes to protections for LGBTQ people and it has yet to legalize same-sex marriage.